Last year, the YSU Penguins went six and five. Ready, set. Four out of five of those losses were by seven points or less. When you play in a conference like we do, the difference between winning and losing is about this much. You have to be on point all the time because you, you, you never know what's going what's gonna to spell the difference between winning and losing when you're in a close game. Today we'll see how the team is looking to improve for the upcoming season in the new YSU. The new YSU is brought to you by Sweeney Chevrolet Buick GMC. Members of the YSU football team run through drills and repeat play after play. Head coach Bo Pelini says the goal is to improve the players' consistency. Come on, Jam, let's beat them. You know, it's kind of gone back and forth a little bit for offensively and defensively. The competition's been good, but our level of consistency isn't near where it needs to be. And, too many mental layers, that type of thing. So it's got to keep working, got to keep pushing. While Coach Pelini is leading the Penguins from the sidelines, Montgomery Van Gorder will be leading the team on the field as starting quarterback. Throughout the season, he'll be handing the ball off to senior running back Tevin McCaster. Well, what really excites me is the offensive line. You know, some guys, they're great. They're, you know, we've got some new guys and we've got some veterans that's here, and they're really working hard, and they're busting their tails just like every other position group. So I'm really excited. Center Vitas Rankwitz says there's plenty of strength in the offensive line to move the ball forward. Anyone who steps up to get the ball, we expect great things from them. So as an offensive line, we really think, you know, the people we have behind us, you know, if we can give them some time, open up some holes, we'll have a really successful year. As for the defense, senior linebacker Armand Delavade sees improvement among a deep pool of talent this year. Everybody wants to run and hit, and it's been a good sign. You know, something we didn't have last year. I felt like a lot of guys would kind of almost take plays off, but this year we have a bunch of guys who just want to run and hit, and it's good to see. Senior defensive tackle Savon Smith is seeing a lot of promise out of the younger players. Uh, we've got a lot of young guys coming in that are playing, you know what I'm saying, and they're going to get some good play time, which is going to give us starters, you know what I'm saying, a little bit of a rest. Um, that way we're able to go all game. Um, I think that's the most, uh, that's the thing that we're best on right now is the versatility in our defense and our offense. And other senior players agree that the younger teammates will play a big role in the Penguins' success. For the guys coming up underneath me, I just want to do all the right things for them and keep the legacy and the tradition, the tradition going. I want to keep it going and show them how things are done. And them guys are picking up really, really, really well. You know, they're flying around, their tempo is up, and they work hard. They push me. There's a bunch of really smart younger guys like Bryce Gibson. Uh, he's a really smart corner for us. Terry Bryant, another smart guy. Cash Mitchell, another really smart guy. But also. They're also getting really uh, smart, so then they can, they can stop playing so hesitant, and uh, it's good to see because they're flying around and having fun. But Coach Polini says there's still work to be done heading into their home opener September 1st against Butler University. Potentially, it's a good group. You know, some guys that are obviously more experienced than others, and trying to bridge that gap. You know, develop a cohesive team that, that communicates well, that plays hard, and and most importantly, plays physical. We're a lot more energized, you know, we're all fired out, ready to go. After last year's disappointment, I think uh, this team's really going to be fired up. I'm really excited about, like I said, the versatility we have, the depth we have, and these guys can fly around. We're a very fast defense, we're physical when we need to be, and I think we'll go uh, far away this year. We've had a bunch of good practices so far this camp, but I think we just got to keep working day by day, and we can't let up at all.